can come up and do yeah. whatever they want. I don't I care. I'm an open fucking bro. I got you 100%. And listen, bro, I appreciate you being genuine with me, man, too. You got to, you know, with your abilities, with your abilities, and I'm going to send my cell phone number and talk with you over the phone and stuff like that, too. I'd like to involve you, bro. This thing, or, um, I'm on the Dr. Phil show December 13th. Uh, you'll see exactly what I do, though. Man. I change. Oh, are you really? You got on the show. That's wonderful. I'd love to. Yeah, that's great. Shout out to Phil. You know, especially the whole, you know, therapy thing without actually engaging in therapy could be beneficial to many people on, on television, which is kind of the angle that I'm taking with it. So I, I get it too. Aaron's freaking out in chat right now. Aaron, I'm trying to help you, brother. All right? Stop All right. being ridiculous. All right. Well, let's, let's, uh, let's definitely. I'm going to talk with Aaron, man, and then uh, let's, let's link up. Let's figure out. Do together, all right, brother. Listen, just DM me through here. It's the easiest because it's a clusterfuck, and we'll, you know, we'll, we'll okay share information, and I'll talk to you, bro. I don't care. You got it, man. I appreciate I you, man. Thanks, you, brother. Look, we're all out here trying to grow and get our message out there, and I get it. I understand what you're trying to do, yeah, and man. I appreciate it. Okay, don't worry about it. I've always loved yeah, talking. Really it's fun. And I appreciate you, brother. You be easy, right, man? All right. You too. Yeah, guys. So I mean. That's as much as it's going to be. Everybody says, hang up. Shane is looking for fame. All of this stuff. Listen, Shane is a jokester, and he does all of this stuff. Looking for fame. If you're going to say he's looking for fame, you're going to say I'm looking for fame. Aaron called me. My girlfriend was joking with him. I work in this. I live stream every day. This is what I do. This is what he does. You know, he tried to do the same thing I did. And unfortunately, you know, it's up to Aaron to want to be helped. You get what I'm saying? Aaron needs to listen to the people around him. Just like this conversation I had with this fucking kid. It was fine. You know what I mean? Like, that's what I'm saying. Sorry, guys. Um, my girlfriend is amazing. Yeah. Aaron wants to take me down. Yeah, he's a loser. This is the best thing that ever happened to me. And uh, you guys can check me out on this is a sales pitch, too. But I don't stream on YouTube. I mean, I don't stream on Instagram uh, live. People, I stream every single night here talking to people in chat. And people donate to me. Shout out all the love. The Daniel Day Lewis flick is that's There Will Be Blood. It's my favorite movie of all time, and it's um it's a character study on um the American dream and greed, and uh, it's just an amazing film. Shout out Paul Thomas Anderson. I'm fucking in love with that dude. Aaron says I'm not a kid. Aaron, you are mentally right now because of all of the drugs and abuse that you've been through. Um, your paranoia and anxiety has given you the problem solving skills of. Uh, like a 12 year old with mental capacity. I'm not fucking with you, Aaron. Um, I tried to help you. You keep bringing my name up. Now you're framing this like I'm going at you. I never did shit to you, bro. So like you're freaking out and like getting all nervous. Nobody's coming at you, dude. I'm going about my day. I was with my girlfriend for three days. I didn't even say a fucking word to you, bro. I didn't even look at your stream and I found out that you were spouting off shit about me and then trying to steal her from me. You want me to leave you alone? You're in my fucking girlfriend's DM saying you're going to steal my fiance from me. Are you fucking retarded? Like, I understand that you're mentally, like, delusional, but are you fucking retarded? Okay, so just shut the fuck up, dude. Aaron goes, I hacked into my phone. That's weird. And lie. He said your girl is being abused by you. Yeah, because he's slandering me. You can ask her yourself. It's very weird. Aaron does need help, and everybody who doesn't understand that and is in here um, saying, I know, actually, if you guys are concerned with my girlfriend's side of the story, she's speaking here on stream. You just type in Gamble84. Aaron, she's yours now, really? Because I'm, I'm here with her. My girlfriend doesn't want anything to do with you, bro. She saw the weird, crusty cum on your hand and the fucking dirty dick pics that you took and deleted. Aaron, you're pathetic. 
And this public meltdown that you had, unfortunately, and if you continue to go at me, right, it's going to condemn you for the rest of your life, Aaron. You understand it's very hard to come back from this. You need to get help and get sober, all right? Because the audio clips of you abusing Xanax again are quite damning, and those are going to be released soon as well. Shane, I'm trying to help Aaron. Yes, Aaron, I saw the DMs from her. I took her phone and sent them to you, you stupid asshole. Nobody hacked your phone. You gave me your number and sent me pictures of your penis. <laughs> I have multiple people who saw it. I'm not going at Aaron. He's going at me. Do you guys not see this? <laughs> Wait, all of you guys blindly defending him is so stupid. I hope you know that I have my people who are here watching this laughing and donating. So you could just go to Gamble84 on YouTube. <laughs> Yo, this shit is hilarious, bro. Hey, baby, I love you, by the way. I'm sorry that this weirdo shit's happening to you. Hey, Aaron. Jason hacked your phone. Aaron, did you know that if you zoom in on the other screenshots in the trash, um, those are... Those are your pictures, right? Like you took those screenshots, like all within context. It's not a setup, dude. He keeps having his bit accounts shutting down my account. What's a bit account, eh? And your account's not shut down. Oh, you mean bot? He said, I love you, baby. <laughs> Yo, everybody comment BSB on top. Hey, Aaron, I just want you to know that I was hired by Nick Carter um, to troll you. <laughs> I'm kidding. But uh, Backstreet Boys on top. You're just telling everyone that your girlfriend writes to other dudes. Hi, Enoya1401. Um... You sound like a fucking retard. Have you ever been in a relationship with trust? Because while I lay in bed with my girlfriend, she goes, hey, look at what this fucking faggot texted me. <laughs> and then I get to take her phone and then say shit to him. She's a catch. She's the best. Oh, my God. Cool story, bro. Hey, Aaron. Aaron, hold on. This is actually going to be really funny. Hold on. Everybody spam BSB on top real quick. Hold on. Yo, should I go sing fucking Backstreet Boys song? Should I do Backstreet Boys karaoke? Hold on. I could do that. Aaron, you you really just need to get off the internet, bud. Because I'm not even going at you. You're giving this to me. Like, you're gifting this to me. You literally felt like, listen, I am one of the most notorious trolls on the internet, okay? It's really bad. I've been doing this for a while. Like... It's true, okay? But I really was trying to help him, dude. It would be cooler to just be friends with Aaron Carter and, like, do fun troll shit with him instead of going against him. It doesn't make any fucking sense. But he's fucking crazy, dude. I'm sorry. Aaron, does this fucking... Does this hurt your feelings when you hear this? Like, do you fucking... Do you shake when you hear this? I honestly can't believe this is happening. He handed this shit to me. Yo, BSB top. Hey, what's up, boys? BSB on top. BSB on top. BSB on top. BSB on top. Aaron. I made more money on live streaming in the last year and a half than you ever will. Without ever mentioning you. You called me. You gave me your number, you stupid fuck. You sought me out. 
You remember that? We back, baby. BSB on top. Aaron, I'm cooler than you, bro. This is 2019, and I'm cooler than you. We support. Dude, you're a fucking asshole, man. Am I sexual? Yo, they love me. Yo, let me see some DXs in the fucking chat, boy. Hey, baby, are you going to leave me ever, or are we getting married? Okay, tell everybody in chat for me, would you? I love you. Hey guys, you want to see Aaron's dick? Where am I hearing Backstreet Boys from right now? Oh, there it is. Hey, guys. You guys are foul. Thank you. Hey, guys. Do you want to see Aaron's cock? Do you guys want to see? Wait, hold on. I think I could show. I could show, like, because he does. He's gross. He, like. I don't know why he leaked this to us. I get like I think it was. A, hey, baby, are you there? I think it was a weird thing. I think he just wanted like to show his dick to you. Like that was the vibe that I got, right? Like I think he just wanted to show his dick, like the fucking chat. Hold on, guys, give me a second. Um, listen. So he does this weird thing. Like, God, this is so high resolution. First off, your nails are so dirty and gross, bro. But what is this on your hand? Hold on, guys. I can I could show this um well enough. No, we don't want to see that shit, bro. Okay, fine. Right, I'll show it on IG. Look, guys. Listen. Look at Aaron's sweater. Look, 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 look. This is his hand. His hand is around his dick, which is here, but I'm gonna hide it. But look, look at this. Aaron, do you have eczema or is that cum? Is that cum on your fucking hand, dude? What is that? Seriously, what is that, Aaron? Aaron, I'm just I'm just curious, dude. Aaron, you can't take care of yourself. You're on the internet. I'm making money. This is my job, dude. Right? Like it's your job. You're supposed to be a fucking washed up uh, duster head. Don't you have a reality TV show to film or some shit? Like go to sleep. Like wake up early tomorrow. Um, this is my job. You're on the internet getting run by a 26-year-old in his dad's house who you offered to fly out to L.A. to set up your stream for him. Yeah, I'm seven credits shy of a bachelor's. I worked for a therapist for a year and a half administering batteries of testing, like uh, the, the PAI and um, other acronyms escape me. You need help, Jill will do it. Damn, Carter, you're going crazy. Shout out to CIA. Hey, your job is to criticize people's dick pics. No, I mean it. Well, yeah, actually, kind of. No way. Isn't that cool? It's like it's a weird future that we got, man. I mean, he sent it to me, man. He's trying to say weird shit. Oh, and just in case you guys are like concern as to whether or not like the, the validity of whether or not it's him i just want you to know that like those are clearly his tattoos i'm sure like fans of aaron understand that those are his tattoos and, you know right 
Like, hmm. Aaron, remember when you were asking, like, if Joel, like, used Discord and, like, would help you build a computer? He's like, oh, Nick Carter runs, Nick Carter runs Discord. He's how many Alienware computers? It's amazing. Aaron, I'm not trying to hurt you, dude. I'm honestly just trying to chill with my homies. Um, you tried saying that I was trying to ruin your life, which I never was. So I reached out to you and said, hey, you should talk to me. And I talked to Shane. And you're kind of just losing your fucking mind right now. To be real. Like, that's what's happening. Okay? Just don't worry about it. Look, man, I was nice to you, dude. Look at our conversations. Yeah, dude, what happened? I saw you were in the hospital. Let me know whatever we could do to help. You never even said anything back to me. Get better, baby boy. Let's get to work when you're ready. People need to know what's up. The truth about you being abused and how everybody's out to get you and how I was going to help you. Remember all that? All those nice conversations that I have recorded that you gave me permission to record? Yo, I love, also, shout out all of the fucking, like, pathetic teenage girls <laughs> with all, like, the stupid, like, seriously, you, you guys, you guys really need to fucking, like, get a hold of your shit. All of this blind, like, following Aaron Carter nonsense is so pathetic. Oh, they're all old, they're, they're boomers, right, 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 because they, right, right, right. All of you fucking washed up, oh, God, I'm not even going to talk, it's just pointless. He's so, he's not mad, Aaron. He's clearly calm. <laughs> Thank you, that's true. I, I like seeing some. Aaron, um, can you explain what charges I should be expecting? Because it sounds like you're trying to threaten me with criminal charges. Which almost sounds like you're trying to frame me for something. So, should I notify my local PD that somebody's threatening me? Just in case. I'm sure that would look really good for you, especially given the context of all of this, right? And your mental state and all of the court proceedings and restraining orders that you have and the public image that you have and all that shit. I'm sure that would really look great, dude. I'm sure that would be fucking phenomenal. A professional at ruining people's lives is fucked up. I was trying to help you monetize this weird little niche that you have right now of people wanting to watch your dumpster fire fucking ex-junkie life. I was trying to help you. Just like Shane is. Everybody's trying to help you. Unfortunately, you need to want it. Can't help somebody who doesn't want to be helped. And you're just constantly lying and manipulating and all of that. And it kind of makes you a bad person. It kind of does. Kind of makes you the worst kind of person. Hey, Aaron, do you want to go live? I'll talk to you. Are you too much of a fucking pussy? <laughs> nah, I'm sure you will. I'm sure you'll come in here. Come on, Aaron, call me. Call me, Aaron. Don't be a bitch, Aaron. Another bot. <clears throat> Dude, Aaron, you have schizotypal personality traits. I want you to Google that real quick. At the end of all this, like when you're trying to take like a really congested shit because you're like on opiates or Zans or whatever the fuck, I want you to Google schizotypal personality traits real quick. And paranoid schizophrenia. We got the death threat. Ooh, I'm so shook. What death threat? You fucking retard. It's not his fault your girl writes to him. 
Gamble using his intelligence to smash on the afflicted, unbecoming, to be honest. Hi, Summer Sweat. Nice to see you. I'm not doing anything. Aaron was fucking with me. Like, seriously. I tried helping him. It's ridiculous. Aaron is insane. <laughs> BSB on top. Hey guys, can everybody spam BSB? He did not force her to write. What do you say? I told my girlfriend what to say to him. She said, hey, babe, look, Aaron is trying to steal you from me. Because I told her two days before he ever said it that Aaron was mentally ill and he would try to do that. Remember that, babe? Oh. Oh, what do you know? And why did I know that? Because he's mentally ill. Because I understand people's behavior better than most people do, right? Huh. Aaron, you were successful for like three years, dude. You went on the Disney Channel. You know what I'm saying? LMG shut down. Hey, guys. Everybody, real quick, leave so I don't get any viewers. You're suing me? Aaron, I really hope that you do. I really hope that you sue me. Please. Because... Please sue me. Please? Thank you. I will counter sue and I will represent myself. I swear, listen to me, mark my words right now. If Aaron Carter tries to sue me, if he tries to come to Florida, tries to sue me in any way possible, right? For anything, libel, slander, threats, literally anything, anything. I have every interaction recorded with fucking kid. I've broken no laws. I've only disseminated information that he willfully sent to me and gave me consent to broadcast. Yo, shout out the backdoor conquistador. I love you, dog. Right, Aaron? I got it all there, and it's perfectly fine. I can't wait for it. Also, you're delusional with drug abuse history. Currently has a restraining order against him for threats. Currently was just ordered to get guns taken away from him. You honestly think anybody's going to fucking listen to you at all? Aaron, the world is falling apart, Aaron. Turn your fucking phone off. Aaron, you're literally losing your mind. This is going to get so bad. Aaron's fans are cringe as fuck. Yo, shout out to you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. The only reason I'm not, like, responding to every fucking question is because, like, I don't know who's doing what. But fucking spam hearts and shit. Let me see hearts. Let me show love. If you guys think that uh, like Aaron's a retard, spam hearts. Um, put DXs in. BSBs on top. Gamble for president. I actually, I'm with that. I should be president. Uh, Aaron keeps saying it's coming. It sounds like Aaron's threatening me. Hey, Aaron, you should call me. Aaron, I could go all night. Because I am a warrior for truth. Wow, you're really tough. Attacking a vulnerable guy. Wow, Elizabeth Mueller. I'm not attacking him. He attacked me. I offered him to help set up his live stream. He said... DX is trying to ruin my life. I said, what are you doing? No, I'm not. He said, fuck you, and hit up my girlfriend. You want context? Look at the VODs. I'm not going to spend hours going through this bullshit. One day you will, and I'll be here. Is that a threat? One day I will. What's up, Aaron? Aaron, stop threatening me. Aaron, call me. Aaron, stop threatening me. Aaron, call me. Aaronoid is a paranoid schizophrenic. Mm. Yeah, I actually don't drink alcohol at all, though. This is hilarious. I almost feel bad laughing because he clearly has issues beyond his control. He does honestly have issues. What am I saying here? I'm saying, Aaron, turn off the phone, get help, go get therapy. Technic I could be the bigger person and just end it, but, like, this is what I do, bro. I expose mental illness. I expose what people do. I expose this toxicity nonsense. I move on from it, okay? We all have laughs. We all whatever. Aaron, this is what you make it, okay? Nobody's harassing you. You're willfully talking to me. This could be your saving grace, okay? 
I could be a personal fucking therapist. I could be a champion for you. You get what I mean? But, like, you don't fucking give a shit, dude. You just want what you fucking want. It's sad. More. I'm here. You deserve me. Please, babe. Hell. Oh, my God. Aaron, um... She's talking in here. You can hear her on stream, and she's laughing at you. It's kind of weird and awkward and sad. I don't think she wants anything to do with you, buddy. Stop calling his lady babe, you weirdo. Why is Aaron Carter obsessed with me? Aaron Carter's doxing me. Aaron, you spell it like this, though. Hold on, I'll correct it for you. Can we report Aaron for doxing? No H, buddy. Hibiscus Circle looks beautiful tonight, Aaron. Thank you. <laughs> Aaron's doxing me, guys. Look. I love this. So Aaron says he's going to sue me, right? It looks like I can sue Aaron Carter. Only because we're actually public figures now, you know? That's an issue. That's my name right there. Oopsie. How's Hibiscus Circle looking this time of night? Oops. Uh-oh. Not good, buddy. Aaron, I don't think you know how to troll, dude. And you know that, like, if anybody shows up right now, it would clearly be associated with you. And we're going to see Aaron in a little red jumpsuit real quick. This is actually going to be great. Aaron, I really did tell you that I'm the type of person that you probably shouldn't try to fuck with, like, on an intellectual level. Faggot. Let me get some DXs in the chat. Aaron is projecting because he relapsed. Does anybody have uh, clips of Aaron um, saying he was popping Zans the other night? I do, but I just have to fucking sift through it. Well, hey, guess what, guys? I guess you all got something to look forward to in the next few days. You guys aren't going anywhere, right? I mean, you know, this is TV. You do have access to it on your phone every day, don't you? It's a good thing I'm live every day. God, it's nice to be me. BSB on top. 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 Big ballin' with my homies. I told you, Summer Sweat. Yo, what up, Johnny Chad? Yo, what up, Hanky? Yo, what up, everybody in the fucking chat? What's good, people? Aaron's coming at me. Are you fucking retarded? Aaron needs to stop. 
It's very simple. I told Shane, if Aaron apologizes, it's over. Aaron doesn't troll. Aaron doesn't know how to troll. Aaron is mentally ill. Only smart people who are sane can troll. I don't think you guys understand. All right? I don't think you guys know what the Joker really is. I'm just saying. A lot of people, you know, want to play the part. A lot of people don't know what the fuck they're doing. Big balling with my homies. <clears throat> Sexy. Yo, shout out Nick Carter, by the way. I'd love to fucking talk to him. I'd love to do some Ouija board shit. Hold on, Mama Bean, I'm coming back. Everybody. Aaron is unfortunately mentally ill. But it's not his fault, dude. He's paranoid. I could be on your side, Aaron. Aaron, you had a sip of whiskey? Oh, no. Everybody's a little mentally ill. Most people just know how to deal with it. Right. Well, the whole point of mental illness is that is people who don't know how to deal with the the day-to-day -day struggles and shit. So... That's what that's all about. Hi, Aaron. Hello. Yeah, no, I know nothing about Nick Carter. I haven't met him. And uh, anybody who has rape allegations against them is not cool with me at all. Um, but in light of the fact that Aaron has blatantly lied about me, right, like to my face and shit, it really makes it seem like a lot of things that he says are not credible. You understand? That's just how logic works. It's like a math problem, you know? Like I get that some of you probably haven't been to college. Um, I could probably, like, get a whiteboard in my room or something and, like, try to guys, try to teach you, try to guys, oof, try to teach you guys uh, finite math and shit like that. But honestly, I don't think we're going to get anywhere. You get what I mean? <sighs> I tried to help your mom. Pushing you into psychosis, Aaron, unfortunately, doing Duster for 15 years. It doesn't take a lot to, like, fall into behavior that can be observed as psychosis. Like, you don't even need catalysts for that. Honestly, toxicity and, like, interacting with people on the Internet negatively can probably exacerbate that. So you should probably just turn your fucking phone off. Internet's probably not for you, dude. You should, like, you should go out to a farm and, like, raise puppies and just disconnect. 100%. Yep. No, I love you guys in chat. <clears throat> the chat's so different from my from IG to here. It's all of Aaron's fucking gang stalkers, like little obsessive boomer women in here. And then in my chat, it's everybody who loves me. It's awesome. You guys are just giving us so much content. It's amazing. I love you, Shmiki. Carmen, Aaron, the Illuminati and Cabal doesn't exist. I'm sorry. Why does Aaron love your girlfriend? Yo, what up, LMG? Because she's fucking amazing, dude. She's the best thing ever. How about I marry a girl and we breed puppies together? 
Um, so what, like, are you saying that the only way that you're going to be able to, um, live your life is by taking my girlfriend? Why don't you find your own, you fucking weirdo? Like, I get that you're desperate, but shit. People love me, Aaron. You know nothing about me. Literally. Everybody loves me. Everybody who knows me. You can tell people they hate me, but people who spend... time and understand who I am and what I do and how I help people.